Okay, I'm back while my daughter's asleep. I'm gonna see if I can fight this fucking dude. Alright buddy, take the Alchemist Rape here. Good luck to us all. May we win this fight, first time back. Pray to God. No fucking way. Did you, what the fuck? What the fuck? It was like one shot. It didn't even hit me. God damn it. <laughs> Shit. <sighs> it was so close to being the first fight. That's really upsetting. God damn it. Okay, but this sword does a lot better. And plus my people stayed alive. Holy shit. Bit of poison on my blade. And let's go! Let's see if you can ward off this fight. 
shit. Ah, oh. was fucked up, man. I was fucked up. I was pinned against the wall. What was I gonna do? What was I going to fucking do? It's okay though. The scimitar is definitely helping. I just wish I, had, I need a shield breaker weapon. Is what I need. I was hitting X instead of fuck. I'm used to X being the fucking block button for games. Like, or like, yeah, isn't it? No, it's grab and fucking for honor. Getting myself mentally psyched. Well, that was my fucking fault. Damn it, again. Damn it, damn it, damn it. I'm not being as smooth as I was when I first started. When I first started, I was fresh of mind. It was wonderful. Now I'm fucking tainted with anger. Oh, shit. All these fucking ants, dude. What the? Why don't you just fucking go up high enough, you piece of ass? God damn it. That's what's so annoying is when he does that little swing attack, it's just in the range. Fucking hitting me. I need to swing to the side of him. Well, the thing is, there was, I see that other attack. Motherfucker.
this face! God. Holy shit. We did it. Never want to do that again. Oh shit. Shit, we might as well go into bedry. This time it only took me what, 15 minutes? Oh shit. That sounded terrifying, whatever that was, but I don't want to fucking fight anymore. Shit, man, I fought everything I needed to. That wasn't very fair. Well shit, man. Why the fuck am I here only to get fucked even worse than I was when I was outside? Let's go ahead and leave Glinden Moffer. Glindaska Moffenoffer. I don't understand what the point of killing that dude was. I mean, obviously it was a warning to tell me not to go here. 
Fucking stupid. He obviously didn't kill him, so where the fuck is this guy at? Where did you go, Vasco? Fucking bandits are everywhere during the night. Met South Road. Let's take some of these travelers' tunics and fucking. Okay.
Hammer of the Forgotten God. What? When did I get that? Alright, let's go back and break down... Wait, it won't let me break down hats. Fuck. Okay. Can't save. Region of Hikmet. Okay. So at the expenditure of way too many health potions. Shit, we might as well see what's over here. Dude, that one's fucking huge. No fucking way. I mean, come on, we could have killed those. That was pretty simple.
Okay, I wonder what happens if I try to stab this fucker. Instead of the other fucker. Oh my god. Alright, we'll come back to this guy. Can't do it now. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's what, 3 o'clock. Okay, let's go. Let's just fucking go, guys. It's not worth the stress. Let's just go talk to people. Come back and kick these asses whenever we, uh... Oh, that must, that must be the guy that he was talking about. Motherfucker. Fuck me. Dude, oh my god, fucking gun spamming piece of shits. You think for flintlock pistols, it'd take them a little bit longer, you know? I'm not feeling like I want to eat this oatmeal. Having a hard time thinking I'm gonna enjoy it because I'm so fucking pissed off. Blueberry and vanilla does not sound like a good combination to me. Ooh. Yeah! <laughs> 
Oh shit. Oh yeah. Is that a new flintlock rifle I just obtained? Okay, well I gotta have my accuracy up. Hey buddy. Guess you can't Guess you can't use it either, huh? I was like there were definitely more than three. Why are there so many of these fucking things here? That one's fucking huge. Shit. All right, well we got that one. Fuck. Things are hard, man. Sometimes the running gives me a little bit of nausea. I don't know if it's like super super fast for me or... I know I've been saving a lot but uh... This is one of those games. We fought enough of these, though. We're good. Good guys. A bit of poison on my blade. Then let's go! Let's see if we can up this fight! Dude, I thought that was a fucking beast in the distance. I was so upset. <laughs> I was like, no. I need a bit of. Am I supposed to get a? Damn it.
It's not possible just now. So close. Let's see if we can go make something with science! What the heck, man? Then I saw another fat ass buffalo, it's gonna be very sad. Let's go back to camp and then we'll come back here. I can just make one outfit for science, that would be dope. I don't like the, you know the thing that kind of irritates me is when you go to the blacksmith on video games, like even, even, there's others, this isn't the only one. But you have to fucking... Kind of irritates me that they're like, oh you gotta bring your own supplies too. I'm like, what the fuck do I need you for? Oh, craft it. I got that. Now let's go! See what this world has to offer. I'm assuming if I had Viger 3, it'd probably be a lot better. It's not possible just now. Are you fucking kidding me? Damn it. I need an elemental damage. How do I not have one of those? I used all of them? Be dope if it was ore. Or an alchemical preparation of elemental damage. But it's not. It's fucking. Wait. But I do have one. Now we. Oh, no, do you no. need something? I'm asleep. Nope. I'm Just gonna chat. Just gonna shoot the breeze. I'm gonna go up there and look one more time. Instead of elemental damage, unless it's a science too or something, then it's just enable. Ah, <sighs> man.
It's not possible just now. Oh, I'm not wearing it. That's my problem. Shit. I'm an idiot. I'm a fucking idiot. Okay. Good job, guys. Fuck them up. Scared of what I'm gonna find. Okay. Is there anything here at all? Oh, there's a chest. Okay. All right, let's go. Right, nice. Okay, so where are we going? going? Around the campfire and then going north. That's where we're going. Da -da 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 dope. Wait, did I level up? I did, didn't I? 
Aj. Jo. I'm gonna save because oh, I've been wanting to roll. Successfully navigated our way out of fuck town. Fucking land sharks look terrifying. Let's just go north. How's it going, Mr. Trader? thing. I dread fighting these. Oh my god, this is going to be miserable. Bit of poison on my blade. Yeah. Nice. Holy shit, guys. We pulled through. Fuck yeah. Okay. Oh, shit. Okay. There's that. What's your destination, my lord? Just into town. I am an emissary of the congregation and I'm here to discuss matters with your governor. Why the checkpoint? We've got orders to verify all comings and goings. The roads are becoming dangerous. Do you have anything particular to report? Nothing out of the ordinary. Well then, good travels, my lord.
Are there any traders around here? Mm. That's a fucking big city. How do we already have a region set up here? Jesus Christ. I thought we... I mean, it's on fire, but... Jesus Christ. I had no idea there was something this large here. Halt! Your names, titles, and business at hand. Sir de Sardé. Emissary of the Congregation of Merchants on Tia Fredi. I have come to present my regards to your governor. Your papers seem to be in order. Welcome to Hikmet, Your Excellency. Thanks, dude. Come closer. Come closer. All my wares are in the vanguard of... Your Excellency, well... You will not... And always... <sighs> Sovereign potion. For this, uh, this city. We better go and meet this governor without me. We are at war. I'm not certain that I can remain calm if I see such a man. We rarely bow down on our ships. I hope I will not embarrass.
Thank God she warned me. Find out the secrets of the layout of this place. Nothing here. I didn't look over here though, did I? God damn it. Dude's fucking living the life, huh? Just living like Larry. Anything over here? Let's go. Excuse me, buddy. Nope. All right. It is an honor to meet you. It is an honor allow to me to present my allow sincerest present regards, regards in the name of the congregation. The of of the congregation. And allow me and to allow wish me you and your cousin you a warm welcome to the island, in the hopes that this visit will help visit prolong will help the profitable relations between, between our two nations. Likewise. 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 Nevertheless, another Nevertheless, question brings me. Question the Malachor. The, the Prince D'Orsay hopes that these new shores will bring us new possibilities. Even a remedy. It is an area that concerns us greatly, but be assured we are studying it acutely. Our doctors and alchemists are particularly interested in the flora of the isle. It's extremely varied and different from our own. In fact, we have sent a group of explorers into a very promising sector. Alas, we've had no news from them for quite some time now. We are hoping that nothing has happened. We would have sent a patrol to investigate, but we cruelly lack the means to do so. The natives have proven aggressive, even hostile to our studies, and have attacked us regularly. We are obligated to maintain all of our able-bodied men here in order to protect the city, but we would be happy to share with you the results of our research if... Your Excellency. This insolent interruption is untimely and unwelcome. I deeply regret, Excellency, but one of our frontier posts has just suffered a brutal attack. Report then and be precise. The natives attacked us by surprise. Our men were massacred. Our frontier post is lost. One more act of barbary. Dismissed, soldier. Where was I? Yes. We would be most pleased to share our discoveries with our allies if your cousin would send us a party to help us find our lost expedition. I could show you to which region they were sent. I thank you for the information and will let him... If you are of a mind to accord me another request, I would be truly grateful. I'm listening. As you have not failed, our troops as well as our caravans have been... ...including are raided, often killed, and certain goods have become scarce. Captain Rainhild, who commands art in the plains, has communicated capacity to protect them. Considering that certain of your own fellow are involved, you would like me to lend a hand? I will see what I can do, Your Excellency. Would you like to speak with me about any other subjects? 
I met Ulan, Ulan chief from the village of Namri. He is an open-minded man who holds great expectations of exchanges. He would like to meet you to discuss a treaty, even an alliance. Ulan, you say? I have never heard mention of this name, but to finally have an ally among the natives could only be beneficial. That is excellent news. Still, I fear that I cannot leave the city. That would be taking too much of a risk. I doubt that Ulan will come to Hikmet. He is looking for an alliance, but he is not desperate. Such a gesture would be considered opposed to the concept of emissaries. Do you think that solution might work? I think that might be possible. He would understand that you could not come to see him in person for the same reason. Excellent. Finally, some clear skies in our negotiations. And Matt, to find Ulan. I'll be there too. To everything goes according to our plans. Another matter can the same to bring to you. Merchant. Who authorize his entry into the city? I see no harm in that. Merchant is certainly not a threat to us. And he might even prove you. If the negotiations with his clan should take a foul turn. Here, please be so kind as to give him this letter of passage. If he presents it to the guards, they will let him in and he'll be able to establish his stall in town. I thank you. I hope to see you again. I have to go. Look forward to seeing you again. Farewell, my lord. <laughs> All right. Hopefully that doesn't backfire. I hate the music here though, like, ugh. Just annoys me. Oh, fucking get out of my way, please. Thank you. Running, <sighs> <sighs> running, running. What time is it? 31. Definitely is possible. If you come to do business, you should go upstairs. I am but a poor underling. Hello, sir. Is this the house of the man called Farat? It is I. What can I do for you? We're searching for Mr. Darcy. He was supposed to come here to do business. To do yes. business. Yes. yes, he did come here, yes, he did but, come here uh, but I don't know where he I is. Don't know where he is. <laughs> to be honest, <laughs> our exchange did not exactly go as planned. And if you are his associate, or a member of his family, know that you owe me a large sum of money. How so? Well, this Darcy fellow came here to take the shipment, and he was supposed to deliver me a promissory note. Which never arrived, I imagine. How could you let him leave with your merchandise without payment? 
Well, he's the son of a very well-known family. I did not deem it necessary to try and obtain more guarantees. What if something happened to him? Nothing happened. At least I don't think so. Why should that concern me? I'm not his brother. He owes me money, and I do not have the slightest idea of where he might be. I suspect that you're not telling us everything. Oh, uh, come on. If you have not come to repay his debt, leave me alone so I can work in peace. Greetings. If you have come to do business, head upstairs, if there's any business left to do. Why do you say that? They haven't been paying me, and I've had to work with cheap ingredients for weeks. What do you do here, exactly? I create and prepare complex potions. Not simple health potions, but far more subtle things. And if I'm not mistaken, things are not going the way you would want them to. The boss has always boss been has difficult, always been. but ever since he got ripped off, it has been a living hell. I work using leftovers thrown away by all the other ass while listening to him screaming at me and everyone else all day. This is no way to live. Have you heard of a man called Bastian Darcy? It would be difficult not to. The my boss told apparently he did not pay for one of our shipments and still left with the goods. And now my boss makes me work twice as much to compensate for his losses. With ingredients I wouldn't even feed to a pig. And what did your boss do? Well, <coughs> he spent every waking hour cursing his name. That's how I learned about it. How can a brilliant, conscientious alchemist keep working here? I am certain that any great laboratory in town would welcome you with open arms. So why continue protecting your employer? This position may not be the most rewarding these days, but it wasn't always like this. Well, I tried. We'll leave you to your work. Uh, how kind of you. You again. I all you may not know where he is, but you did everything you could to find him, didn't you? What do you mean? Does this document ring a bell? You hired some debt collectors to find Mr. Darcy. How dare you rummage through my belongings? You could have taken legal action and retrieved what you were owed, but you sent some killers instead. I doubt the governor would approve. Do you want us to tell him about it? No. But please, understand me. The Darcy family is on the continent. It would take months for them to reply to my complaint. What other solution was there? My shop will not survive this. Tell us who these debt collectors are and we'll take care of it. They loiter in an alleyway of ill repute, not far from here, in the science district. That's what I feared. Probably a bunch of cutthroats. If Bastian survives... If he survives, remind him of what he owes me. I mean, even though the guy's an asshole, he did get ripped off. <laughs> I wonder what happens if I go here. Well, that was pointless.
find the quintessence of alchemy, the best potions and the most efficient construction. Have mercy, have mercy. I will reach. Hey, you! Leave this uh, man alone. What do you want? No one asked you for your opinion, so get off. This guy's dumb. Maybe he's friends with the weakling. Maybe. In any case, it seems like he wants to share his fate. You think I'm afraid? I fought uglier people than you. Vasco, let me try to take care of this. How much money are we talking about? You're here to collect a debt, right? Between what he owes our client and our commission, it's a hefty sum. But if you want to pay in his stead, my lord, please do. I don't think you realize who you were dealing with, so let me introduce myself. My name is Desai. I am the legate of the congregation, and I am here to save the life of one of our citizens. Do not deliver him to me immediately. I will have no choice but to inform the governor. And you'll end up rotting in jail in no time. That looks serious. Yeah, it's a bit too much. Listen, I think that was going to work. trouble with the governor, so take him. Yeah, if our client wants to get repaid, he'll have to make an official request. Come. Thank you for your intervention. I thought these brutes would kill me. Don't mention it. It's only mm. natural. But how did you end up in such a situation? Oh, I'm certain someone like you, who belongs to high society, will understand. There is a game table here that is attended by the best of the aristocracy. I lost the money I owed to that merchant while playing there. And since I got out with a few other debts, I had to leave the merchandise as repayment as well. But that's a mere trifle that my father would have paid for without thinking twice. I never would have thought that someone would send these types of brutes after me. What a lack of tact. In any case, I am extremely grateful to you. To whom do I have the honor of speaking? My name is Captain Vasco. Nought and sea given. It was a pleasure, sir. Desarde, can I do anything for you? Can I do anything? I must leave you. Thank you, Desarde. My pleasure. But why didn't you tell him who you were? But I did tell him. I was stupid. I resented everyone, and you even more, for the life I didn't get to live. You had it all, everything I thought I was entitled to. But after seeing Bastion, I realized that in the end, I was exactly who I wanted to be. A naught, and a proud one at that. I'm glad to hear it. No more regrets? No more regrets. And I certainly don't regret not being called Leandra Darcy. Greetings. Greetings. I immediately spotted that I have all. We also I selling. All, we also sell Make one health potion. They just buy them for more. I was honored by your visit. Greetings. Greetings. I was honored by your visit. Please come back whenever you want.
Oops. That was almost bad, wasn't it? Hello, Captain. Hello. Your Excellency, Your what Excellency. can I do for you? What can I do for you? Governor Burren has asked me to help you fight against the caravan attacks. Could you tell me precisely what's going on? For weeks we have been harassed by the savages. They're waiting for groups of soldiers or caravans to be out of sight of the outpost and attack with incredible violence. They don't just steal goods or equipment. They kill without mercy. Only one man survived their last attack. He's here in a sorry state. Do you think he could answer a few questions? Yes, but take it easy on him. I'll make sure I do, Captain. Hello there. Hello. My name is Desarde. I'm the legate of the congregation. I was informed that your caravan was looted and that you were the sole survivor. It's true, Your Excellency. It was. We followed the recommended precautions to the letter, but it was useless. How did the attack happen? We traveled all day. We were exhausted. The night was. We knew we were not very far from the outpost, but we couldn't go any further. So we camped away from the road trying to stay out of sight. Alas, it was in vain. That's when they struck, in the middle of the night. Were there several attackers? I counted five, maybe six. But others were hiding in the woods. I'm sure of it. If they only had their usual stone weapons, we may have hoped to escape them. But their weapons were inflamed. I have never been so scared in my life. What were you transporting? Mostly food, but also herbs and other ingredients for scientists. Did the attackers take it? Everything was a blur. I don't know if they intended to steal or destroy it. Unfortunately, my companions died. Are you saying that the loot has started by attacking your cargo? Yes, Your Excellency. Maybe more of us would have survived if we'd all fled. You mentioned recommended precautions. Yes. Since attacks occur often, we were given enough. Do not travel at certain times. Do not camp near the road. Do not... All of it was useless. It would have been better to recruit... Hmm. Based on what you're saying, they must have a camp near the outpost. But what is their goal? They must want to cut off the... We'll go to the scene of the attack. I'm wondering if there's like a sacred like Please help me Please. just keep walking Renaixe This does not concern you Have mercy They will kill me I am but a merchant who wishes to trade with the big city. I never thought I would see several islander warriors attacking a mere merchant. And I thought honor and righteousness were of the utmost importance in your culture. <laughs> I must have been mistaken. What are you trying to say, Renaixe? Are you insulting us? You're insulting yourselves by behaving this way. He's an unarmed man. He's trying to survive. What honor is there in attacking him? He is a traitor. He deserves to be punished. But you are right. He is not worth attacking. Let's leave. His punishment will come once we have chased the Nanaixe away, and he cannot sell his products. Think nothing of it. Ulan told me that you were not able to enter the town. It is true. They left me outside, 
and the Donaya Exdragao took... Rest assured, I have obtained permission for you to enter from... ...which should allow you to set up your... ...at Loreda Renaixi. Farewell, merchant. Perhaps we will meet again. The caravan was some distance from the road when it was attacked. <laughs> Here we are. Here Stay, we are. Alert. Stay alert. The food has been destroyed. They clearly don't need it, which means that their camp should be close by. The crates are empty. Their entire contents have been destroyed. These goods were not meant to reach their destination. They must have died protecting their goods. How sad. These wounds appear to be caused by stone blades. The kind of weapons that islanders use. They acted quickly, methodically, and then left. But where are the bodies? Let's look around.
Here we are. Here we Stay are. alert. Stay alert. The crates are empty. Crates are empty. Their entire contents Their have entire been destroyed. Contents. These goods were not meant to reach their destination. They must have died protecting their goods. How sad. These wounds appear to be caused by stone blades. The kind of weapons that I would use. Found it, Dada. Been destroyed. They clearly don't need it, which means that their camp should be close by. They acted quickly, methodically, and then left. But where are the bodies? Let's look around. Why was this man's body arranged like that? There's something in his pocket. Haha, <laughs> shit, my bad, dog. This trip will be my last one. Very cautious. We even ate cold food every night. But I was letting the fire was too dangerous. He was in the caravan, but whoever attacked him decided to drag him here and feed him to the wild beasts. 
The Donea Ectregal do this as a sort of scare tactic. This is a message for other merchants. Shit it is. It's really kinda hard. Sorry if my connection breaks up. It's not like someone was hitting them all in there. playing whenever you invited me. What's up? No place to play. I don't have it downloaded. Mm. Need download. Why do I need to download it? Say that we can play. I don't like it that much. Then 
Yes, and I thought about playing it. That doesn't mean that I want to. Why would I buy a new game just to play something that I've already got? Well, I've got Greedfall and I've been playing it. Dang it. How can three of us not take this one dude on? Put up a good fight. Out of him. Good one, buddy. Yeah, it just started raining here pretty bad. Are you home from work? Finally. Here's the camp of the rebel natives. Ah. The standing men called themselves Donea Exregal. Please, let's try and talk to them. Okay. to fight with my brothers without trying to reason with them first hey guys can we talk about your freaking douchebaggy ways hello don't worry i come in peace i only wish to speak to your leader oi i'm the leader of this camp renaixe and who might you be my name is the sade i'm the legate of the merchant congregation the congregation are those the lugeid blau the yellow eyes it's possible yes we live in the city south of the island. That's right. We hold no grudge against your people. Talk. Oh, well, that's, that's open I want to speak to you about your attacks against all those who take the road to Hikmet. The Lions only got what they deserve. They have captured many of our people. We must release them. That's the price of war. If you fight, you risk men being taken prisoner. I am not talking about warriors, Renaixe. But villagers kidnapped in our villages. Would you say sorry? I'm missing the dialogue. Damn. Those carrying the mark of the oh, bond like playing a game. They capture them, and we never see them. Even if I did, it won't be downloaded by the we time. We don't know what they are doing to them, but we are going to release them. I see. But our merchants have no role in this. They are not warriors. So why kill them? They brought food and weapons back to our enemies. We could not let them pass. If your merchants had fled. We would not have pursued them, but they resisted, so they do it. The city of Lyons <laughs> is no longer so they do it. food or weapons. Nothing. I share your anger against the Lyons, and I also hope to find our captured brothers. But the Rinaixe also use floating houses to transport things. Your attacks were useless. Listen, if what you told me is true, I fully understand why you're fighting. I'm even ready to help you clear up these disappearances, as long as you spare our merchants. You no longer need to worry about it. That was our last attack. Our troops are ready, and soon we will make the Luyan pay for the harm it has brought upon us. What are you talking about? Soon, the Donea Exregal will march together, and we will free our brothers. Can you guarantee that our merchants will now be able to take this road without risking their lives? I always keep to my word. The time for small attacks is over. Now is the time of war. I'm afraid you're heading straight into a massacre. But since you promised me that our caravans will be spared, I have fulfilled my mission. Go in peace. We should prepare ourselves. Oh boy! What about playing Skyrim again? I'll play it occasionally. I'll play Fallout 4 more, but. Oh, 
Jesus. Playing what? I only got off to like, um, in the military. What was in the military or something? Oh god, it's taking me. I hope I will not regret letting them go. They are so full of hatred for the Alliance. Dodonaya Exregal fought, as my mother did, to free our people from the Lions. And now, they are ready for a great battle. I hope they will not end up like my clan. I have to admit that the story of this attack is concerning. We should we talk, talk to, to Captain, Captain Rainhold about it. We can also inform him that the convoys will now be running smoothly. <laughs> Jesus. Everybody be trying to die and sh Everybody's got a Leo. And everybody's gonna die. Man, I really need to stop playing this game. I played it so freaking much today. Hello, Captain. Your Excellency, what can I do for you? I managed to trace the rebels who attacked the captain. You eliminated them. No, that's not necessary. But you must know that this group is part of a much bigger army. An army that is ready to go to war against Hikmet. We have been at war with the rebels for a long time. They did not speak of skirmishes, but of a pitched battle. They want to free their imprisoned comrades and will stop at nothing to do so. This is terrible news. We must prepare the troops immediately. I'll send a message to Governor Buran. Thank you for warning us, Your Excellency. You've given us a chance to resist their assault. I know it's not much, but I hope you'll accept this as a token of gratitude. Thank you, Captain. Well, what the fuck am I supposed to do? I don't want everybody to die. Are you eating something? Yeah, it just sound like you're on. Manawi, do you need something? Yo, Kurt. Yo, what that Zwei hand to do? They have to go try hard. I keep on hearing myself and it's spotting. Who 
Ulan, I see, I see that the that governor, governor of Hikmet's, Hikmet's emissary is already here. He is. And I am very thankful that you succeeded in organizing this meeting. I am full of hope for the future. We are very grateful as well, Your Excellency. However, if you could leave us, I am sure you can understand that the discussion we are about to have must remain confidential. Naturally. I hope that you will reach an agreement. Wait a fucking minute, that sounds sketchy. Sounds disgusting. Is there anyone I can f f f fight? Come here! Yeah. There would be if you were to play. Yeah. I like playing things with the story and progression. It does have a story. It's not have a fucking story. You could, you could equally play outward or something with me. Oh shit. That's what I thought. A little different when I suggest something, isn't it? Shit. Even when you did, you didn't play it. Dang it! No, you did it! <laughs> There we go. Now you're gonna die. Yeah. Get him. Nice one, Kurt. Let's go, boys. We gotta see how the meeting went. Hell yeah. Dude, I feel like I'm gonna walk into some people being slaughtered. 
I don't like that. God, I hope somebody didn't die. I orchestrated this whole meeting. God, please, God, don't let this be bad. So, have you reached an agreement? Our discussions were very fruitful. However, we are faced with a problem. Really? Our peace treaty depends on the ability to exchange freely. And Chief Ulan has warned me that our merchants would be at risk of being attacked by the neighboring clan, Mordun. The chief of the village of Vigugson is a Denea Exregal. He is among those who think that the people of your island are only here to take from us. But his village would also benefit from this agreement. If you could convince him to meet us, we could reach an understanding, allowing the caravans to pass through his territory. Without this, I am afraid we would not be able to make a commitment. Peace and trade are linked. If our merchants lives coming here... We am sure that you will manage to convince him that the Renaixe are not all bad. I can try, at least. At the Red Hour. We will wait here and hope that you will manage to reason with him. Okay. Jesus. Always gotta meet somebody. Christ. What time is it? 420? Ah, 420, bro. <laughs> Wait. Where's this guy's? Fellas, we gotta kill. There's some uh, things over here that need to be killed. One of them is definitely scratching his ass against something. Yeah. 
things are about to get. Nice, guys. Nice. squad is my squad is the bear bullies Find every bear we can find I need a bit of practice Let's go. What's up, my friend? Glad to see you, my friend. I intend to prove to the Admiral that I fully identify as a knot once more. Without regrets, I will have to go through a test of loyalty. It will certainly be dangerous, but with your help, I am convinced that I will succeed. So, shall we go and see her? It would be my pleasure, but I'm too busy at the moment. Later, maybe. Did you want anything else? I must leave you. Okay. Smoldering club. Smoldering. Smold. Flint axe. Mental damage, 56. That's pretty cool. I do like their elemental weapons.
Oh wow, it has elemental damage. Hello? What are you doing? I'm just sitting here playing the game while Dahlia's sleeping. No, I need to talk. What's going on? Hold on, Austin.
Things are about to get dicey. Hey, sorry. You there? Austin said, hey, mom's on her way home. I'll just give you a little heads up there, buddy. She didn't say anything. I was just letting you know. Hiya! I missed it. My name is Wiener Boy. I got a small wiener, and I'm a boy. I hope these guys don't fight me. That would suck. Let's see if I wear their clothes if they'll accept me. Oh my god, my teammate sucks. Well, that's no way to talk about your teammates, dude. Hey guys, you're not gonna fight me? Would they fight me if I took the tunic off? Hey boy, over here, so it scared me. Oh shit, they have these beasts tame. Ew. This guy does not look like he's an a Looks like you. What are you doing here, and I say? Your coin are not welcome in my village. Listen here. Ulan, the king of Vignamri, wants to establish a trade agreement and sign a peace treaty with the governor of Hikmet. Looks he would do. Ever is picking up the crumbs left behind by the all of that 
in hope of breeding new life into his village. While deceased men and women who live there. Hikmet Semen sign if they're merely as in peace. I am not like him. I am a Donea Exregal. A proud man, not a slug. The Renaixe cannot be trusted. They are deceitful and only seek to trap us. Come on. The Donea Exregal I have met were fearless. And yet you are running away from a mere meeting. By refusing to negotiate, you are only showing weakness, nothing else. Oh, not Fradi. The worst on, part is that you are wrong. So no. We cannot refuse this meeting without appearing weak. For him, I will meet Ulan and his emissary. But I will not go to his village. Tell them to find me at Lambristel. I will be there in a few hours. I will pay. Thank you, Mordu. Okay, sir. You really know how to talk to people. I, I never thought you yeah. would be able to convince Mordu. His anger towards the Renaixe is so strong. Alright, I was just in the fuck. <laughs> Say it all in the Dude, she started and I couldn't stop it. Tell me what she said. Mmm, what you say? That you only made way. Well, of course you did. Mmm, what you say? Mmm, that you only made way. Well, of course you did. Mm, what you say, Austin? Austin? Mmm, what you say, Austin? I don't know why I did that. Oh, it's a little puddle. Yeah, I'm pretty impressive. Village of Vignamari. Vignamari. What do you want, bitch? Bitch, 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 bitch. Mordun is willing to meet you at Lanristal to sign a peace treaty. You really are an accomplished negotiator and diplomat, Your Excellency. I knew you would succeed. Thanks to you, the region will be at peace. What are you doing? Do you know of course, in our language, still means glade of pieces. It is a sacred place, one whose peacefulness must be respected. It bodes well. In that case, we should go there at once. Yes. I will follow you. Come back to see me soon. And if luck is on our side, we will celebrate peace together. Ulan is acting strangely. I do not trust him. We should go to Lan Ristol to make sure we're not being tricked. Wait a minute. If you want to see this encounter, we should leave now. Wait a f Wait a minute. Why did you What the hell? Why didn't you say something before that? You guys Oh my god, you guys. I arranged all this negotiating and now everybody's gonna get fucking slaughtered. Great. Great! That's exactly what I wanted to happen. <sighs> mm, what you say? Oh, look at those ruins, those are pretty. Scenery's gotta be my favorite thing about this game. Wonderful. So many questions.
fucker. Oh no! No. Zedulan. Oh, I should have known he would betray us both. My men are dead, and now I am injured. He achieved exactly what he wanted in the end. I will have to join another clan if I do not want my whole village to suffer the consequence. Sorry, Mordu. Just like the death snake. On all men up, and do not let yourself be betrayed again. The fuck up this dude. Then I'm gonna march right into that freaking capital and murder some peeps. Ooh, 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 ooh. They don't even know, man. Ulan, son, you about to get fucked. Ooh. Seething with anger. Oh boy, you about to get fucked. I'm about to beat the shit out of you. Traitor. This meeting was meant to establish peace, and yet you have exclusively sent armed men. Odun was a Denea ex-regal. He would have never accepted an agreement with the Renaig Say. He would have endlessly attacked our merchants and our allies' caravans. We had to protect ourselves if we were to make these exchanges possible. So we did. By lying and manipulating me. I am sorry, but I was unsure that you would agree to help us if I told you the truth. I understand your anger, but keep in mind that we are now at peace, thanks to you. You are now a Karans of Ignamri, and should you seek it, you will always have our assistance. Anything else? What do you think of people from the continent? Many of our people would love for all, but I wouldn't. The Loyans, the Lugaid, Lugaid Blau. It means yellow eyes, because there seem to be their coins. And what does Teleme offer you? The man of the boy wish anything. Nothing. I must go. Well, <sighs> didn't let me kill him. I'm a very upsetty spaghetti.